Are we re- we're recording. The light's on. <laughs> hey, Garbies. Welcome to Garbing 101. We have a very special guest in the studio today, so let's get started. everyone. We have a very special guest in the studio today. She is a creative technologist for a nationwide media company, an up-and-coming Twitch TV streamer, a long-time Rennie, and now Garby, and she happens to be a close personal friend of mine. You may know her as Level Up Lady. Please welcome Julie. Come to the studio. Oh my gosh. You look great. Thank you. This looks awesome. Thank you. Um, Are you comfy? Yes. Yes, I'm very comfy, Super, actually. super comfy. Um, <laughs> it looks really comfy. Mm-hmm. Um, so let's just dive right in. Okay. You uh, have been garbing for a really long time. Yes. How long has it been? Uh, 18 years now. 18 years. Yes. Um, what was the first piece of garb that you ever <laughs> got? I mean, did you make it? Did you buy it? What was the first piece that you ever bought for yourself? Um, so my favorite character at the time was Rydia. And okay. she had green hair, she was a little girl, and then she grew up to be like this big, strong, badass woman. And I was like, I want to be like that when I grow up. <laughs> um, so Star had green hair, she was a badass, um, so that's why I sprayed my hair green. Um, and this was also the first time I made my own garb. So nice. my grandmother bought me a sewing machine. Um, I wish I brought a picture of it for you. Oh, well. It looks horrible, but it's, <laughs> it, like, in a hilarious way. Like, now I look at it, I was like, oh, my God, what was I thinking? Oh, God. <laughs> um, but sh- it, it was basically a black bodice with, like, plastic flimsy boning. Oh, nice. So, like, it just kind of did this. <laughs> right. Showed off all the curves. Yes. Right? <laughs> uh, but it was too big. I measured myself wrong. Oh, great. So it was falling off. Oh, that's nice. With the shirt that was falling off. <laughs> um, and I had, I actually made that at the time, my staff. Um, that's why I brought it. Um, <coughs> Excuse me. And then a just a red skirt. Nothing yeah. matched. Nothing matched. Nothing fit. <laughs> but I loved it. The first thing I bought was a snood. That, that's what it was. A snood. A snood. Can you please explain to our Garbies <laughs> what a snood is in case they don't know? It's literally a net that you tie your hair up with. Yes. And it's the most annoying. It's the most annoying. <laughs> hardest <laughs> thing to put in. So yes. as a first time Garby trying to put that on my hair, I was like, no. Yeah. So let's... I think yeah. like two years later, it was just gone out. <laughs> you were like, done. I gave up. <laughs> it was done. And now we wear our hair down with fun clips and hats. Yes. Yes. <laughs> um, so uh, obviously you have a sewing machine and I know that you make, um, do you prefer to make your things or do you prefer to buy them? Or is it sort of a little of both? It's a little of both. If I can't find something that I have in my mind that I want to add to my mm-hmm. pieces, I will go out and I'll make it myself. Okay. Um, if someone has already made it and I love it, then I'll give them, like, I will pay for it, especially if it's good quality. Yeah. Um, Because I also like to support other creators. Yeah, Um, that's that's big for me, too. So Mm -hmm. that's awesome. Um, And, you know, what keeps you going back every year to fair? It is, it's an escape. It's like my second home. Um, I grew up doing it, and a lot of my friends do it now, and so... Uh, a lot of people kind of, like, they have fun when they go once a year, and then they, they're kind of shocked to know that I go almost every weekend. Yeah. <laughs> but it's... I get the same thing. Yes. <laughs> um, but people spend, I don't know, this is just a random example. People spend lots of money going to, like, a bar to watch sports or, like, go on a cruise to just relax. Like, yeah. this is my cruise every year. Yeah, I go absolutely. to the fair. I will sit at at a table and just people watch all day all day and it'll be just the most relaxing thing for me yeah absolutely yes. I t- i'm totally there with you mm-hmm. um and i think a lot of people uh feel the same way so what do you have uh tips wise for anyone getting started and uh starting their sort of garb journey first figure out what you want to basically figure out your character what what do you want to look like originally um yeah. the biggest mistake i know people make is they'll just buy a bunch of random stuff and throw try and throw it together just because mm-hmm. it looks cool because they like all these different things yes yeah. but they don't essentially go like mesh together mm-hmm. um 
figure out your character, and then buy a piece a year. Don't try and buy the whole thing. Um, yeah. Start with your shoes. Those are gonna. Those have to be the most comfortable thing because you're gonna be walking around a lot. Mm -hmm. um, and then just work your way up. That's yeah. Yes. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> now I know you're streaming on Twitch.tv. Mm -hmm. What games are you currently streaming right now? So every Monday I stream Overwatch. Um, okay. And that's with uh, Mikafu and Chance and some of the other guys. Um, and then <clears throat> eventually I'm going to be adding on more days and I'll be doing indie games and some beta tests that are coming out. Um, so that'll be Fridays and Sundays. Awesome. Um, and then just randomly here and there. <laughs> well, I know we have a lot of people that are really interested in, you know, gaming and garbing. Mm -hmm. So uh, definitely check her out on twitch.tv. <laughs> Mondays and Wednesdays, 8 to 10, mm -hmm. right? And then Sundays from noon to 10. Right. Right. And um, hopefully we'll see Julie again in the studio. Yay! Yay! <laughs> uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share Garbing 101. And we'll see you next time.